Now, you may be off work today, but many people are still on the job helping those who need a hot meal on this Thanksgiving Day. Greer Community Ministry feeds about 350 people daily with their Meals on Wheels program. The program needs your help in order to make this a success. Christine Scarpelli live now there with more on how you can help. Christine. Hey Kim, good morning. Absolutely, yes. Yeah. So Greer Community Ministry is doing much more than just Meals on Wheels. This morning we were showing you exactly what ingredients your donations go toward. Four dollars feeds, oh gosh, many different people and it goes to many different things. If that's something you can donate to Greer, Greer Community Ministries, it's a good thing to do. Um, first off though, you know, the meals are definitely part of it, especially today with everybody delivering yes. them. But this is so great. This is something a little bit different. The 12 days of Christmas. Krista, tell us just a little bit about this and kind of the work that goes into it for Christmas. Yes, we're in our fourth year with our 12 days of Christmas. Our Meals on Wheels clients and our senior diners will get a gift a day for 12 days with their meal. Um, we have people donating starting in July. We start getting these in um, oh, because we need, it's going to be 4,400 4, gifts total all individually wrapped wow. and um, we give them and some of our clients keep them until Christmas morning to open them up. It's Absolutely. so sweet. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's the thing. And you know, that gift means something, but so does that meal. Every single day you guys are in here on Thanksgiving, you know, giving those meals. Right. Um, this is something where some of your people, they just can't get to the store, right? Or can't make their own meal. Exactly. And it's just some of it's um, usable things like lotion, but some of them is just a treat you know, and, and a fruit bag and things like that that are just fun that we all like to get at Christmas. So uh, we like to just treat them during this time as well. Definitely donations. What is the best way for people to donate? You know, it's Thanksgiving coming up on that time of giving. People are looking for a way that their money is going to make a difference. How do they do that? Uh, they can go online, gcminc.org. Uh, they can do cash donations. We'll take canned goods also, clothing, um, gently used clothing. Um, today they can go run in the five can run over at Eastside High School. There's a run this morning at 9 a.m. They can do that. It's only five cans to enter, but all the donations go to us. Very good. And as Kim said, what a coffee. The price of one coffee helps feed, feed someone. There exactly. you go. Exactly. I love it, guys. All right, Kim, we'll have plenty more coming up in just a few minutes. Back have, to a you. Cr have a quick question for you. It's so exciting yes. that the Meals on Wheels helps people who are homebound, you know, for hospital reasons, medical reasons, things of that nature. 12 days of Christmas. I love that. Now, do, right? you, do they need people to donate money or to donate gr gifts for each of those days? Krista, what's better, gifts or money to donate for the 12 days of Christmas? Well, actually, we've gotten most of our gifts in already. But if they want to donate those gifts starting next year, that's good. But, but the cash really is the best way. Absolutely. And these guys do as much as possible with every dollar. Awesome question. All right. Thanks so much. I love that idea. We'll have to keep our viewers yes. posted. Thank you. Okay. If you're already looking ahead to 